All right, we're here with Carolina Hurricanes defenseman Jamie McBain on the way to the Panini America uh, booth for a, an autograph signing, and Jamie's been nice enough to to uh, participate in some Donruss pack busting. So just Jamie, first of all, while you're opening, I wanted to ask your thoughts on what was the first time, or, or what was your reaction the first time you saw your own trading card? Uh, it was pretty exciting. I, uh, I got it from... Uh... A fan actually gave me one one, one day, the first time I'd seen it, so it was, uh, it was pretty exciting. My uh, my parents actually, as soon as they heard that it was out, they went and bought all the packs of cards too. I think they said they went through over 100 packs and <laughs> they finally found it, so that's uh, pretty exciting. Was it, growing up, was it something you uh, you dreamed about, being on your own card? Oh, absolutely. I mean, I grew up uh, just collecting a bunch of hockey cards, still got them all saved back at home, so it's uh, you know, it's pretty special to finally uh, you know have that dream come true and be on a card myself. Now, when's the last time you actually opened a pack of cards? Um, I guess yesterday, just just to be able to do it for a little promo yesterday. Yeah. So it was, uh, yeah, that's the first time I've done it in uh, you know, quite a few years. So. Now, uh, while you're opening, kind of talk about what the highlight of your career has been so far. It's been a year plus. Yeah. Um, in the, uh, I guess it's just it's almost been uh, kind of. Just surreal and just trying to enjoy every moment of it. So I don't know the, uh, you know, last year probably the, you know, the thing everyone dreams about is scoring that first goal, and mm -hmm. so I was able to get to do it last year in kind of uh, dramatic fashion, scoring uh, an OT winner against Pittsburgh with you know like point to the nine seconds left on the clock. So that was, uh, yeah, that's obviously something I always dream about, and it's been quite the experience and something I'll never forget. And then, but just being in the league and full timer this year has just been an awesome experience. I've loved every minute of it. Cool. Well, now if you get a chance to crack up one of those packs, let's uh, Let's see what we got in here. You're a pro at opening those things too, man. Lot, <laughs> yeah, not, not my first time opening <laughs> there, so. uh, it's Zetterberg, got uh, Alfredson, uh, Brad Boys. Were you much of a collector growing up? Yeah. Were you? I had, uh, yeah, I mean, I, I, every day I would go and try to get some new cards and uh, actually got, uh, I, got uh, I think it's, I might even have Gretzky's rookie card. It's his rookie card or his, uh, one, one of his cards that when I looked up it was worth a couple hundred bucks when I was younger. <laughs> I mean, it was, uh, it was pretty, pretty special to have that. I got it in the safe back home, actually. Yeah. In, in my uh, childhood home, so. so and uh, so Chris Tang is here this weekend. Uh, Spetsa. Heatley's. Now, when you look at a few of those guys that, that you've had the chance to play with or play against, what I mean, to see in their card, does it take you to a game or a moment that you spent with those guys? A little bit, yeah. I mean, just the, uh, you know, just when you get a chance to play against uh, you know, Old Tang in Pittsburgh all the time, so seeing them, uh, seeing it on the card just kind of you know, brings back just some, some games, you know, played with them and, you know, you know Alfred and things. So Zetterberg, I haven't, I haven't had the chance to play against yet, but I uh, watched them a lot on TV, so... You know, that, uh, that moment's gonna come soon enough. But, You're right. Uh, so yeah, but I mean, it's, it's fun just looking at the cards and especially seeing guys, you know, that you, uh, some of them are around here this weekend and some right. that I've, uh, that I've played, uh, played with too, so. Now, what are your thoughts when, uh, when, when you, you, you know that your game-worn memorabilia is on a, a piece of it's on a card or your autograph's on a card? I mean, that, that's not something that, that a lot of younger Collectors have had the chance to, to to experience until recently. I mean, what are your thoughts on that? I like it actually. I just uh, I was just given uh, um, uh, some packs actually the other day to sign, and they had the game worn jerseys kind of attached to it, and I was I was, I was kind of stunned. I was like, what is this? Like, I hadn't <laughs> even seen it before. So it was uh, you know I like it a lot. I like the idea behind it, and it's uh, you know it's a cool little attribute. Cool. Now you, we're gonna go to uh, the Raleigh. Convention center right now, where there'll be a packed house of Hurricanes fans waiting on your autograph. What, what's uh, what's the scene like uh, here in Raleigh when it comes to, to autographs and, and how people love the Hurricanes? Oh, they do. I mean, it's it's pretty incredible. You know, it's a, uh, a team you know further south, you wouldn't maybe quite expect to have the, the fan base that we have here, but it's uh, um, you know they're they're absolutely amazing. They get uh, you know they're one of the craziest fans to play in front of, and obviously to have them cheering your backs. So, Pretty impressive, but you know they, they love the they love their their Kaniac Nation, you know. For yeah. Sure. So they, uh, you know, they're they're really excited about this event. I mean, just being uh, being around the city and, and everything like that for the you know the months leading up to it. And when they actually got announced that Raleigh was going to host it, you know, this, this city's been pretty nuts and they've been antsy for it. So it's uh, you know it should be a lot of fun. The mock draft yesterday was uh, 
was uh, was great. You know, great turnout for that. Too. Absolutely. So it's, uh, yeah, so, I mean, it's, it's it's a fun time to be in rally right now. That's for sure. All right, so go through that pack in your hands and kind of give me a one word. Uh, the the first word that comes to mind as you go over each card. Uh, Dad Sukes. I mean, again, I haven't been able to play against him, but he's, he's one of the best players in the league. So it's something that's actually kind of funny. I got uh, my own teammate right here, Zach Boychuk. So it's uh, <laughs> it's kind of funny looking at him. He's got a funny face in that place. I <laughs> have to give him some grief for that one. Please but, do. Uh, um, so yeah, and then a couple of, so a couple of guys I went to uh, Madison. I went to Rene Bork. Cause he didn't go there when I went there, but he went to same college I went to. So it's just you know, Dowdy, great Good. player. Um, Thomas Vanek, I watched him a lot when he was at the Gophers at uh, well, growing up in Minnesota. So the, uh, another one of my teammates, Tomo Rude, too. So, <laughs> so, that's a good pack yeah, to open. That's a good pack right here. So, so, yeah, that was a fun one. Well, Jamie, man, I appreciate you doing this, and uh, good luck this weekend at the festivities, and we'll uh, talk to you soon. Yeah, thank you. All right.